All right, here I'm testing out Need for Speed Heat. Playing on the Steam Deck through the Oculus, oh, sorry, Meta Quest 2 using the huge screen VR app available in SideQuest. Need for Speed Heat. As you can see, you got your Steam Deck right here on the interface just to prove it. Once again, back in. Way back here, huh? Can't stay away. We're gonna go ahead and get a race. Here. Obviously not getting um, optimum frame rates out of the game, but it is playing without any kind of latency on the control. Oops, using the uh, PS4 controller. Looking directly through the Oculus Quest 2 from the Steam Deck. Like having a big screen theater sized TV right in front of you. You can look around, obviously, it's not like AR, this is VR. You can zoom in and out again if you want to get different views. Out. Go back. That's the furthest back that it can go. So that's pr that's the tightest resolution that you'll be seeing playing like this, which is still a huge screen. You know what I'm saying? Especially compared to looking at the s uh, Steam Deck screen itself, monumentally bigger. So. Just a different way to experience gaming on that device for sure. See? Still getting my uh, messages and stuff like that. Distracting me while I'm driving. This car's about $47,000 of property damage right there. But here we go. That's it. Need for Speed. Need for Speed Heat. Steam Deck. Live on the Oculus. Huge screen VR, don't forget. 